Erectile dysfunction, or ED, is a common condition affecting millions of men. It is the inability to achieve or maintain an erection sufficient for sexual intercourse. While often attributed to physical factors, ED is a complex issue with both psychological and physiological components. Understanding this interplay is crucial for effective diagnosis and treatment. Ignoring the psychological aspect can hinder recovery. Men experiencing ED may feel embarrassment, shame, and anxiety. These emotions can further exacerbate the problem, creating a vicious cycle. Recognizing the role of the mind in sexual health is paramount. Addressing psychological factors alongside physical ones can lead to more successful outcomes. It's important to remember that experiencing occasional difficulty achieving an erection is normal. When it becomes persistent, seeking professional help is recommended. A healthcare provider can help determine the underlying causes and recommend the most appropriate treatment options. This may involve a combination of lifestyle changes, medication, therapy, or other interventions tailored to the individual's needs. To grasp the psychological impact on ED, we must first understand how erections work. There are three main types, reflexive, nocturnal, and psychogenic. Reflexive erections occur due to physical stimulation of the penis. Nocturnal erections, as the name suggests, happen during sleep. Psychogenic erections originate from sexual thoughts or visual stimuli. The brain plays a crucial role in all three types, demonstrating the mind's influence on sexual health. For instance, stress can disrupt nerve signals from the brain to the penis, affecting both reflexive and psychogenic erections. Similarly, depression can decrease libido, impacting psychogenic erections. This intricate interplay highlights the importance of considering psychological factors in ED. A man might be physically healthy, but still experience ED due to stress, anxiety, or other mental health issues. Addressing these underlying psychological factors is often key to successful treatment. It emphasizes the need for a holistic approach that considers both the mind and body. Our mental state significantly influences our physical well-being, and sexual function is no exception. Stress, anxiety, and depression can all negatively impact erectile function. Stress, for example, triggers the release of hormones like cortisol, which can constrict blood vessels and hinder blood flow to the penis, making it difficult to achieve an erection. Anxiety, particularly performance anxiety, creates a vicious cycle. The fear of not being able to perform sexually can itself lead to ED. This fear can be so overwhelming that it becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. The man may start avoiding sexual situations altogether, further impacting his relationship and self-esteem. Depression, often characterized by feelings of sadness, hopelessness, and loss of interest, can also significantly impact libido and erectile function. The neurochemical imbalances associated with depression can affect the brain's ability to send and receive signals necessary for sexual arousal. It's important to remember that ED can also exacerbate mental health issues, leading to a vicious cycle of negative reinforcement. Several psychological factors can contribute to ED. Low self-esteem, for instance, can lead to anxiety and self-doubt, hindering sexual performance. Individuals with low self-esteem may experience feelings of inadequacy, making it difficult to relax and enjoy sexual intimacy. This can lead to a vicious cycle, where the inability to perform sexually further damages their self-esteem. Relationship problems such as communication issues, unresolved conflicts, or a lack of emotional intimacy can also manifest as ED. When a man is struggling with relationship issues, it can be difficult to feel emotionally connected and attracted to his partner, impacting his sexual desire and ability to perform. In such cases, addressing the underlying relationship dynamics is crucial for resolving ED. Past sexual trauma or abuse can also have a profound impact on sexual function, leading to ED, among other issues. The trauma can create deep-seated psychological scars, making it challenging to engage in sexual activity without experiencing flashbacks, anxiety, or fear. It is essential to approach these sensitive issues with compassion and understanding, providing a safe and supportive environment for individuals to heal and regain their sexual well-being. The relationship between anxiety and ED often manifests as a vicious cycle. Performance anxiety, the fear of not being able to perform sexually, can be a significant contributor to ED. When a man experiences anxiety about his sexual performance, it can trigger a physiological response that makes it difficult to achieve or maintain an erection. 
This initial experience of ED can lead to further anxiety and stress, creating a self-perpetuating cycle. The man may become preoccupied with the fear of failing again, leading to increased anxiety and potentially exacerbating ED in future sexual encounters. This cycle can have a debilitating impact on a man's self-esteem and relationships. Breaking this cycle often requires a multifaceted approach that addresses both the anxiety and the ED. Therapy, such as cognitive behavioral therapy, CBT, can help individuals identify and modify negative thought patterns and behaviors that contribute to performance anxiety. Combined with medical interventions to address the physiological aspects of ED, this approach can help men regain control over their sexual health and well-being. Numerous studies have established a strong link between mental health and erectile dysfunction. Research consistently shows a higher prevalence of ED among men with depression, anxiety disorders, and other mental health conditions. For instance, one study found that men with depression were twice as likely to experience ED compared to men without depression. Similarly, research indicates that men with anxiety disorders, particularly social anxiety disorder, have a significantly higher risk of developing ED. The constant worry and self-consciousness associated with social anxiety can extend to sexual situations, leading to performance anxiety and difficulties achieving or maintaining an erection. These findings underscore the importance of addressing mental health concerns in the context of ED. It is not merely about treating the physical symptoms, but also about understanding and managing the underlying psychological factors that may be contributing to the condition. Integrating mental health care into ED treatment plans can significantly improve outcomes and overall well-being. Despite its prevalence, ED remains a stigmatized condition, often shrouded in silence. Men may hesitate to seek help due to feelings of embarrassment, shame, or fear of judgment. This stigma can prevent individuals from receiving the necessary treatment and support, leading to a worsening of both their physical and mental health. It is crucial to break down these barriers and encourage open conversations about ED. By normalizing discussions about sexual health, we can create a more supportive environment where men feel comfortable seeking help without fear of judgment. This includes educating the public about the prevalence of ED, its various causes, and the available treatment options. Healthcare providers also play a vital role in addressing the stigma surrounding ED. By approaching the topic with sensitivity and understanding, they can create a safe space for men to discuss their concerns and explore potential solutions. Encouraging open dialogue and providing accurate information are essential steps in breaking down the stigma associated with ED and promoting better sexual health for all. Treating ED often involves a combination of psychological and medical interventions tailored to the individual's specific needs. For men whose ED is primarily driven by psychological factors, therapy, particularly sex therapy or CBT, can be highly effective. These therapies can help individuals address underlying issues such as anxiety, stress, relationship problems, and negative thought patterns that contribute to ED. Alongside therapy, medications like PDE5 inhibitors, for example, Viagra, Cialis, Levitra, can be prescribed to improve blood flow to the penis, facilitating an erection. These medications work by enhancing the effects of nitric oxide, a natural chemical that relaxes smooth muscles in the penis, allowing for increased blood flow. Lifestyle modifications, such as regular exercise, a healthy diet, stress reduction techniques, and smoking cessation can also significantly improve erectile function. By addressing both the psychological and physiological aspects of ED, individuals can achieve better outcomes and improve their overall sexual health and well-being. It emphasizes the importance of a holistic approach that considers the interconnectedness of mind and body. In conclusion, erectile dysfunction is a multifaceted condition influenced by both psychological and physiological factors. Recognizing the intricate connection between the mind and body is crucial for effective diagnosis and treatment. Ignoring the psychological component can significantly hinder recovery, highlighting the importance of a holistic approach. Addressing psychological factors such as stress, anxiety, depression, and relationship issues is as essential as addressing any underlying physical conditions. Integrating therapies like CBT and sex therapy with medical interventions, lifestyle modifications, and open communication can lead to more successful and sustainable outcomes.
Breaking down the stigma surrounding ED is paramount to encouraging men to seek help without shame or hesitation. By fostering open conversations about sexual health, promoting mental health awareness, and providing access to comprehensive treatment options, we can empower individuals to take control of their sexual well-being and live fulfilling lives. Remember, seeking help is a sign of strength, and addressing both the mental and physical aspects of ED is crucial for achieving optimal sexual health.